So I have two different cages. This one actually can house um, its four separate areas. So I have their inside area. And then the outside area. And ignore all the cords. I have babies out here actually right now because I didn't want to keep them in the house. So they have heating pads in there. And then this one is just three full cages. So as you can see, they too have this indoor area. And they have their outdoor area. And then these ones are um, feather sexable, so you can tell at about two, three weeks um, if they're boys or girls. Um, you might find that kind of useful if you're using them for feed for your reptiles and you want smaller ones, you could weed out the girls from the boys. So I built them and then in between each one, I went to like an auto parts store and you buy the pan the oil pan and it slides underneath there as you can see they wasted a lot of food there and then um, these guys here are not feather sexable so there's kind of some silver colors some rosettas but you're not able to tell what sex they are early oh and I just installed these cups on the back wall for water and that hooks up to this system that rolls down into there so I don't have to refill their waters all the time. In the winter their waters do freeze and I don't use those cups. And on this side I used uh, cereal boxes and just put them up there. Oops. With there's holes in their screen and then I just put it up there and it's got PVC pipes that go down in 